Okay. Oh, another injury. Pinch nerve. I'm really happy with that. Um. Okay. And Yuna. All right. Finally, Lavashfall comes and tries to pick up the ball and does so. I will keep our two guys right there uh, so that uh, the computer can't block them next turn. Instead, we'll have to either blitz or dodge his way out of there. Or dodge his way through our line, should I say. Okay, okay, okay. I like the way things are going so far. Uh, I'll take that. <laughs> Ooh, I'll take that. Cat and Mighty Blow. I won't follow. There's one blitzer here. Oh yeah. That's a good turn so far. Oh, stun too. Awesome. Okay. Um dodge mighty blow. We do have tackle though. Let me reroll. Yes. Good. Ah, crap. Okay. Sadly, uh, Yuna is stupid. That's a bit uh, dangerous since she doesn't have a tackle zone right now. But we do have this troll slayer who is in a bit of a <laughs> difficult situation. Ah, here he comes. Yeah. I knew it. All right. I'll bring uh, Duke Dittern and Dirt. Uh, come on. Ah, crap. <laughs> well, that sucks. Especially since we had this guy who could have been sent out. Oh uh, well, still, we're in a very good position to score. Well, that was nice. Okay, so now my job is to advance. Okay. Now I want to put this runner down. Good. Hmm. 
Okay. Good. And now the troll slayer goes outside. KO'd. All right. Now, depending on what happens this turn, I may score with Lavash Fall or try to give it to Duke Dead and Dirt. Uh, okay. Well, this isn't bad. This isn't bad at all. Okay. Okay. All right. So, why did I bring my rudder here? So that our Pestigore, while blitzing, will have four strength and will also cause problem to the troll. Yeah, that's good. All right, so uh, these two are left. I like our chances. Yeah. Well, that's one free point for La Vache Folle. And a score for Do Dinner and Dirt. Woohoo! I'll take touchdowns with Nurgle Warriors as often as I can. You know, they don't score that often compared to uh, Beastmen, so you have to. Uh, uh, take the opportunity when it presents itself. Hey, two injuries, one out. Two are still KO'd. Awesome. Well, two nothing. It looks like they will have to uh, focus heavily on offense. Mm hmm. I will put my pestigors closer to uh, closer to the uh, sidelines, and I will keep my people right on, uh, on the front line because I want to injure people. Ah, oh, sadly, one turn uh, lost thanks to the riot. Well, that's good. And guess what I'm going to do? <laughs> uh, I will bring Lavashfold here and push him here and then push him outside. Good. Block, block. Push. I can deal with that. And he missed. Good. All right, so I'll start with the blitz. The way is pretty much open to... Uh, the troll slayer uh, with the ball, so I'm taking it.
one down. Two down. Three down and injured. This time he used his apothecary. Now that will help since, yeah, it's pretty much over. I will send Rosie. Uh... Basically what I'm doing here is taking a huge chance. I'm going to assume, and we all know it, that's dangerous, that I will get the ball next turn. All right. I'm happy with that. I'm really happy with that, in fact. Okay. And turn. If we had one more turn, I would really be more... Uh, Comfortable with our chances. Oh, that's nice. Ah, crap. Ah, good. That guy doesn't have... Um, doesn't have guard. And that helps a lot. And that one doesn't have guard either. Okay. Does he have enough move to score next turn? If he doesn't, I'll ignore him. He doesn't. He's a dwarf after all. Doesn't have dodge, perfect. Okay, here's the plan. I'm going to bring a Nurgle warrior here and blitz. That should hopefully give me the ball. And at the same time, it should push the blocker outside. And then, hopefully, with the Pestigore, I'll grab the ball, give it to Rosie, and score. But, of course, that's a lot of good uh, things that must happen. Of course, I'll reroll. Ah, sadly. We still have a chance. Yes. That's good. Okay. Um Try to push him out of the way. All right. Okay, so I don't even have to worry about this guy. Uh, I'll just send Fargunner here. And then hope for the best. Okay. So we have already used the uh, rerolls, sadly, so it's all a question of luck. Ah, well. We did try. And it's over. <laughs> well, that was a very convincing victory. And we injured three dwarves, which is rather rare, I have to admit. So I'm really, really happy with that result. And thus we win the trophy. Roll the four, I'll keep the winnings.
<sighs> Snorag. Marky Desaad! Wasn't he the one who scored? If he was, then... Well, even if he had not scored, uh, five points is enough to get a level. That's awesome. So, let's take a look at the star player points. Yeah! Duke Dead and Dirt got a touchdown plus a casualty, so five points. Awesome. Marky Desaad, MVP, level up. Beganator got a touchdown, three points. Edmund the Purified and Yuna both got one casualty, so two points apiece. And finally, the Vashpal got one point for a success, uh, successful pass. So we should have at least one person who levels up. Ah, wow, Skaven lost big time. Oh well, Halflings ended up finishing third. <laughs> Kinda illogical, but hey. Okay, so Purity Trophy, here we come. So it's the same uh, tro uh, same uh, tournament as for uh, the Drukai Devastators. So, eight teams, elimination type tournament. Uh, let's look at uh, who needs what. Beginator still needs seven points. Two did in dirt now needs four. Seven for Lord Onval. Hmm. Pretty happy with that. So level up. Normally I'll grab tackle. Yeah. If we had gotten something like plus one strength, of course I would have taken it. But now He's a very well-rounded player with Mighty Blow, Block, and Tackle, and Force Strength. So, really happy with that result. Let's take a look at what we'll face next time. Norse Team! Norse Car Rampagers. That's good. Should be interesting. Amazons would be nice to face. We haven't faced one uh, of those teams yet. Orkland Raiders, well, don't care. Dwarf Giants, we just beat them. Chaos, uh, Dark Elf, would be interesting. Camry, eh, anyway. So, another victory for the Black Death. And I will see you next time.